Well, to celebrate our 20th anniversary of Lakeland News, we're taking a look back at some of the memorable local stories we've covered over the years. We're calling it 20 for 20. 20 stories in all, one for each of the 20 years we've been on the air with Lakeland News. Now, we wrapped that series up last week with a look back at the year 2017, but we've decided to include one bonus story for the year 2018, which is, of course, almost over now. The U.S. men's Olympic curling team made history last February when it won the gold medal in South Korea. The team included two players with local connections, and our Josh Peterson brought us their story. Meet the Polos and the Brett Schneiders. They followed their family members to the Winter Games and had no doubt in their minds they would bring home the gold. We were there to support our, to support our team, and we had a lot of faith in them. And they started putting things together and picked the right time to start stringing some wins. The excitement and energy from Team USA fans was contagious and said to play a key role in the men's curling success. They thrive off of that crowd. They, yeah. they tell us that all the time, yeah. that the crowd helps them get positive and get energized. They love it. The reporter on that story, Josh Peterson, of course, continues to provide compelling stories for Lakeland News from his hometown of Bemidji. And you can watch that entire story on our website, lptv.org, tomorrow. That officially wraps up our 20 for 20 series. 20 stories in all, one for each of the 20 years we've been on the air with Lakeland News, plus that bonus one from the year 2018, which is almost over now. We hope you've enjoyed this look back in time and just a sample of the types of stories Lakeland News has been bringing to the viewers of North Central Minnesota for 20 years now. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.